Why did you do this to me, Kubra? Why did you... You won't die yet, Sadula. Not before your revenge. No, not yet. I have something to do. I have to figure a way out. I won't die yet. I have too much to do. I have too much to do. So you decided to act like your father now, huh? I guess that you just want to trick me and force me to marry you. You just want to trick people like he does. But if you're dreaming about having a kid with me, you better forget it. Yigit. She couldn't do it is all. She couldn't kill the baby inside her. Is that hard to understand? She didn't get pregnant alone. I told her from the beginning. If she still wanted to have that baby, then it was totally her business and I will not be included. <laughs> Don't talk to me like that, Yigit. You just can't think it through right now. Oh. I mean, have you lost your feelings because you were mad? It's not the child's fault that this has happened. All I wanted was for both of us to There's just... There's no both of us anymore, Kubra. There is no two of us. Yeah, you are Sadula's daughter, and that's Sadula's grandkid, and I won't be part of that family. Yigit. What? Her father kicked her out because of you. Calm down and don't yell. Yelling won't help anything. So try and calm down. You'll accept responsibility for all of this. It's the right thing to do. Mm. Look, I will cover the baby's expenses. That's okay. Okay? But I won't give a damn thing to her other than that. You got it? So an unborn child even has survival instincts, I guess. <sighs> It's true. Well, I know that you can't make someone a parent by lying to them. You think I'm lying? <laughs> it isn't a lie. I couldn't kill it. <sighs> All I can say is I'm not lying. I'm not trying to lie. Or fool anybody, Yigit. <sighs> we understand you, dear. Don't make yourself upset. We know you're telling the truth. 